Hey guys, Brian Fleming from buildingsocialproof.com. Today we're going to look at a research report that I found on a site called Social Media Examiner. I thought it was really telling on where social media, particularly social media advertising, is headed in 2016. So with this video, I'm going to show you a, a few slides to kind of to kind of build the point. I think you're really going to like it. Now, maybe you've just gotten started with social media or you're thinking of starting social media, you know, the one thing I think we all go through is in the beginning especially, it can be so overwhelming. Let me take some of that pain away from you. Head on over to buildingsocialproof.com where you can sign up uh, for my seven day social media marketing strategy where I'll show you just that, how to create a social media marketing strategy in seven days. One that won't take you that much time. You can get started with, do your social media a few minutes a day, but the most important thing, you absolutely will not feel overwhelmed by it because you'll have a plan that works. You'll know what to do. So if you are feeling overwhelmed by social media, head on over, check that out. Love to love to have you. Okay, so this report, it's got um, some slides from the Content Marketing Institute and eMarketer. I kind of want to go through those slides and, and talk about it because like I said, it really builds up the case that uh, your business should be using social media, both organic and paid. But let's look at what other businesses think, both business to consumer and business to business. I also have my own thoughts on that from my own experiences and those I've had with clients. So let's take a look at the first slide. Okay, the first slide here is the effectiveness of all paid ads for business to consumer companies. Now, when we're looking at this, and guys, this one's a little bit old, but here's a takeaway I want you to look. Look at both um, promoted posts and look at the paid social ads. Now, they're both jumped up. Three out of four businesses that were surveyed said they're doing both of these. They're promoting posts and they're running regular social ads. But what was most interesting to me is the jump, how the effectiveness of it jumped so high from 2014 to 2015. What that says is that the perception of this from businesses is that it works or they believe it's going to work. Uh, that's very, very good for social media uh, advertising and social media marketing in general. And notice, of course, how the traditional stuff is falling off, especially with things like TV, which we'll talk about more in just a second. So the next slide I want to show you is talking again about business to consumer, but it's talking about the platforms in general and what people think are the most important platforms. And check this out. Maybe it's no surprise that Facebook would be at the top of the list. I mean, I think we all know for business to consumer, everyone's on Facebook. So if they're all there and they've got a killer ad platform, I've talked about it quite a bit. But with their killer ad platform, Facebook comes in at the top. Check this out, though. YouTube and Twitter right there at number two and three. You don't hear that much about uh, Twitter and YouTube, but maybe you're watching this video right now on YouTube Guys, YouTube is a huge force to be reckoned with and you just, in the context of social media, you just don't hear very much about it. But boy, man, even YouTube ads work really, really good. Again, don't hear a lot about them. Now, let's turn it around. Let's go to the next slide. You guys can check this one out. This is business to business. And oh boy, look at this one. LinkedIn, way at the top. And then this is what I found super interesting. YouTube and uh, Twitter didn't really move much, did they? They still held that second and third position. And then Facebook for business to business, boom, on the bottom, guys. Facebook is way down. I think I know the reason. I think I know the reason for this is when people are doing business to business in general, they think business people are on LinkedIn, so I'm going to go there. They forget that the people that are on LinkedIn are most likely also on Facebook and if you do your targeting right, the way I've showed you in other videos, you should be able to find those business to business people and target them on Facebook. And Facebook should be through their ad platform, uh, one of your best sources for business to business leads. But that's maybe why this, uh, this study looks a little skewed. So interesting how those switched around. Okay, now on the next slide, um, I have just uh, sponsored social media and just wanted to show you how much more people think that, how much more effective people think that is than traditional media. And guys, I think we know uh, things like television ads, radio ads are just less and less effective than social media. And you know, I heard a quote the other day, I might mess it up a little bit, but you think about the Super Bowl, right? And you think about these people who spent, I think in 2016, a Super Bowl ad was uh, four and a half million dollars 
for 30 seconds and it went to 160 million people watching the Super Bowl. Well, that, that's pretty cool, right? But Facebook serves up 10 Super Bowls a day. They have a billion people a day using their platform. So think about that. You could literally run 10 Super Bowl ads every single day on Facebook. And guess what? It's going to be a heck of a lot cheaper than four and a half million dollars to run that. You get analytics on it too. So no brainer, right? I think we're going to see more of this, guys. I think we're going to see more traditional media bleeding over into social. And there's a little bit of bad news there. The bad news is that ad costs are probably going to go up in the future. So get into it now while ad rates are still cheap because as more people jump in, all these ad platforms work on an auction system, guys. Ad rates will go up. I saw it happen firsthand to Google years ago. When Google first came out, you could buy clicks on Google search for $0.10 cents a piece all day long. And now it's popular. Same click, five, ten dollars $10 a click. Ouch, ouch. That's why you don't use it anymore. Jump on Facebook, better ad rates uh, right now in 2016. So that's all I got to say about that, guys. Uh, some good trends showing if you're doing social, you're doing social ads, you're in the right spot. I mean, other people are seeing great results with it too. And again, you want to get started with social media and you're feeling overwhelmed, you just want an effective strategy you can implement quickly, head on over to my site, buildingsocialproof.com. That's it for me today, guys. I'll make another video again for you soon. Take care. Bye-bye.